New offensive coordinator, Ben McAdoo, he's in charge of turning this offense around. It was one of the worst in the league last year. Not even 18 points a game. So I sat down with the former Giants head coach this week. So what is this time like for everybody in the building? You've been a head coach. There's a lot of rumors. There's a lot of talk around the NFL draft. What's this time like? Well, right now, you know, being in the first year, it's like drinking out of a fire hose. Uh, you know, we have a lot coming at us, so we're getting ready for the draft. We just uh, started meetings with players. You know, we have a lot of preparation, just getting the offense in. So it's an exciting time, but uh, we're very busy. What is the most underrated trait for a quarterback to be successful in this league? Yeah, I mean, uh, first of all, you know, looking at the arm talent isn't a bad place to start. But I think, you know, a guy wins. I think it's important to win. And you look at the history of it, guys who uh, maybe have won at places that don't have a, a history of winning at a high level that kind of can push them, you know, can push it over the top, push their program over the top and, and get them to a, a higher level than they're used to being at. I think that's pretty important. Um, you know, and a guy's got to be able to handle, uh, you know, adversity. Uh, when you come into a place, uh, you know, it's not going to be all smooth sailing. You know, development's different. It's just not a straight line to point A to point B. You know, there's a lot of ups and downs on the way through uh, to get into the player that they're eventually going to be. And you just want to have a guy in here that can, uh, that can do that, that can handle it, that can, uh, you know, play through the ebbs and flows of not only a game but a season. And it's a long season. The mental side of being a quarterback, it's exhausting, I can only imagine, because you got to slow the game down from the on-field standpoint, and then you got to block everything out and just kind of focus on what you need to hear. Right. How do you figure out if a guy is able to do that in these interviews? Is there a question that you ask? Is there, you just pepper him with questions? How do you go about that? Uh, I th you know, we just try to go through, you know, miniature uh, installs, you know, go take them through the install and test them on the install and really see how they, it's really see how they learn. They're all, if they got to this point uh, mentally, then they're capable. You just have to see how they learn and then you have to tailor your teaching really to how they learn. And, and the biggest difference in this game and the college game, uh, you know, in the college game, you have to know what you have to do and maybe what the receivers have to do uh, or who you're getting the ball to. They have, you have to know what they have to do. But up here, you have to know what the 21 other guys in the field are doing. Uh, and then there's a lot more volume schematically that way, and guys are a lot bigger, they're a lot faster, and they're a lot stronger up here. You've been an offensive coordinator, you've been a head coach. What is the biggest difference for you between those two? You know, the way I look at it is if you're a position coach, you know, you're the head coach of your position. And if you're the offensive coordinator, you're the head coach of the offense. And if you're a defense coordinator, you're the head coach of the defense, you're special teams coordinator. You always want to kind of approach it that way. Now, we all work for Coach Rule. And uh, we believe in his brand, we believe in his plan to win, and we're going to do whatever he believes is going to help us be successful. And that's what it's all about. But I think it's important to take ownership uh, of your side of the ball and make sure you put your stamp on it. And, uh, you know, I've, I've always approached it that way. I'm a team guy, so whatever, whatever we can do to help the team, we're going to do. When you watch this film, what has to get better on the offensive side of the ball? What is just unacceptable to you? You know, one of the big things, uh, you know, Coach Rule talks about in his plan to win is winning the turnover battle. And you're going to make, uh, you know, you're going to make some decisions and some throws and you're going to have, you're going to have some turnovers. But what, what we need to do is uh, we need to minimize uh, turnovers based on bad decisions. So we need to clean up our decisions and you're going to miss some throws and they're going to result in interceptions. And that's just football. That's a part of the game. Uh, but we got to hang on to the ball when we hand it off and when we catch it. So we want to keep those fumbles to a minimum. But the biggest thing for us is the turnover ratio. We want to win that. Are you able to install an offense right now? With, because there's so many questions at quarterback. And I know Sam's the guy in the room right now, of course. And I don't think what you said the other day is like crazy because Scott said that Sam is the starting quarterback right now. He is the guy mm -hmm. in the room. Is it tough to, though? to install an offense when there's questions? At yeah, the well, I mean, what I said about Sam, I can clean that up. It's just not my job to name a starter. That's, that's Coach Rule's job, and uh, I believe in the chain of command, and that's, uh, that's something I need to be respectful of. Uh, but I do believe Sam, that we go out and play right now, Sam's the guy, and I believe we can win with Sam. And uh, uh, I think there's flashes there, and I'm excited to get out there in the grass with him and play with him. But as far as the offense goes, we're going to be comprehensive. You know, we're going to put in a big system. Uh, we're going to cover our bases. We're going to see what the players do well. So I don't know who's going to be running out there day one, uh, but we're going to have enough in the system to be able to handle it so we never say no to a good player.